Good out. morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today, Sophie's already finding horses that she loves. No, it's cause it's We've been looking, we always look. She found a really nice horse and there's a video of him. And I think he's too fast. 15-3 but takes up leg. 15-3 but takes up leg. I'm pretty sure that means he's slow. He's. <laughs> no, it means he's chunky. Oh, he's chunky. Yeah, he is chunky. Yeah, he's 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 chunky. Yeah, Anyway, welcome to today is rainy and gray and yucky just like it was yesterday, but that's okay when the rain Doesn't stay away the day by days go and shop <laughs> Okay, I'm not good at uh, I shop not good at rhyming. Okay guys, but anyways we are headed to pick up a bunch of stuff I have to go to the tech store this morning Love the tech store. and I have to go get shavings and chicken feed that's one of the staples that we go and buy every single week so and then we're gonna take a bunch of our junk to the secondhand store so we have a lot of um, chores to get done a lot of running around to do and you're probably wondering well why are you just sitting in the car why are you just sitting in the car when you have so much to do why are we sitting in the car you guys already know I know Sandy knows waiting for Gabby. we're waiting on the Gabby <laughs> I just pulled the push door <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> it's not that I embarrassing. Everybody does like, it. Pull or push. It's a pull bar. <laughs> so we used to have a treadmill and then we sold it, but we want another oh. treadmill. Oh, it's a elliptical. I have videos of Gabby when she was little and she used to go on. That's a nice one. No, this moves. This floor moves and you walk up and down like that. It's like a stair. I don't know, it's nice. Fall don't fall. <laughs> don't break your fall. Leave it to Sophie. She's the best shopper on earth. I've been looking for Build-A-Bear shoes because they have this amazing they have this amazing tread on it and you can use them for miniature ponies or for miniature horses. So I'm excited we're getting them. Next stop, we are at the dollar store and I'm trying to hide from Sophie. Because Sophie is a shopping addict with her dad. There's Sam. I got these. I want to try using these to wash our floor. Look what I found. Jelly Belly drinks. Oh my gosh. We have to get that. <laughs> I want to stop drinking this stuff because I don't like... Wait, wait, wait. Let's see if there's... That. Sucralose in them. I don't like that stuff. Sucralose. It's so bad for you. Artificial sweeteners. But sugar is so bad for you too. And they're $1.75. $1.25. Dollar $1.25. Like that's so good. Hear me out. Okay, that is really cute. Imagine on Canada's birthday, July 1st, my little dog, my little Yorkie, sporting a Canada shirt, Canada Day shirt. <laughs> this is what I mean by Sophie being a shopaholic. Should we get one? Should we get one? It's $10. It's $10. What I is it? The good stuff. It's a clock. Sophie water. finds all the good stuff. We're at the tax oh, store. We're at the tax water, store but... now. Oh, neat. It's like a water bucket for your horse. What are we ever gonna use it for? When we soak Chino's foot. We have so many it's things. It's softer for, on him. We have so many things, but Chino's not gonna get any more abscesses. So Sophie yeah. is dying to get a Lemieux. It's fit honey. I mean, not honey, Willow. All of our horses, we use these for all of our horses. It's because they're so gentle. We, I love them. I know, I know, I love and them. And when honey's like bolting and bucking when I'm running up and down the hill with her, I love to do that. Um, this won't fit honey though. It'll fit Willow. This but is you need a rope halter for honey when she does that stuff. This would be Willow's. Anyways, I think that she should wait for her birthday or for Christmas because it's no, a it's a it's a want. want. It's not a need. What one do you think would be better on Willow's? Uh, purple. It's blue. Blue. Actually, she looked good in red, but I think you should get her pink. <laughs> Personally. So this is the whole Lemieux halter section now. New saddle alert. That's really cute. And you like it? Yeah. It is really nice. What brand is it? They have this one too. That's a big back to try and get your leg over though. I know. We She likes dark saddles. I like dark saddles too. What brand is that? Precision. Oh no. It's called, oh, Circle Y. I love that brand. Oh my gosh. That feels like so comfy. So we spent the whole entire morning shopping and we just got all this we just got all the staples I just needed to get more supplements for our horses every year when I put our horses on grass 
I give them a supplement that helps their body process it a bit better because we have such lush, rich pasture. We give, so this year we added salt and magnesium, but um, we've always given them salt, but we give them a little bit more salt because that apparently is really helpful too. Also, we do some Mad Barn stuff and we do some Alpha and Omega stuff. In the field, we give them salt licks and then in their stalls, we give them salt lake, but we give them salt extra. I also bought chicken food. It's pouring rain. Can you guys see it? We are, we've been emptying more and more buckets in our basin and cleaning them out. I swear we will have a clean basement soon. It'll be like the first time. For you, Hoot. Show them, show her, Sophie. What is it? She had a bath last night and her oh. fingernails are clean. <laughs> Well, it's because I work with ponies. I know, you do. They're dirty right now, because, well, a little dirty still, because I was playing with ponies. Earlier. You only have to run your hands through your, through Honey's hair and brush her to get dirt in your fingernails. And because of the rain right now, oh man, she is filthy. She's black. She's black. But I remember my mom grew up in that generation where if you went someplace and you had dirt on you at all, it was embarrassing and awful. The world's changed a lot since then. And I love that my kids get dirty. I love that at their ages now that they still feel free enough to get dirty, especially when they're at home. I love it. I don't like germs from other people though. Yeah, she's very like germaphobic. But when I was a teenager, I like did not, I would never have been on a farm. I would never have touched a horse. I would never have touched anything disgusting. I would always stay clean, but man, did I miss out. When me and Gabby started riding, she was scared of the horses. I know, they saw. Yeah, um, she never came to her lessons. Yep, not at first. And then you came once. I did come sometimes, but in the middle of winter. Ooh. She's an Appaloosa now. Wow, you really are an Appaloosa. <laughs> so somebody said that she looks really skinny, but look at her face. It's the funniest thing. Wait. She's so cute. Every time we go somewhere. Let me show them her. your face. So. Oh, her hair is getting curly. Okay, so her face is normal, but she's got these white things at the side. Actually, it looks better. Looks like it's coming out more. Anyway, she had like all this white hair on her sides, so it made her face look so skinny. It was insane. Um, but she looks okay. She it's needs kind muscle. Of come out. Yeah, that's what happens when you roll in the mud, baby. Um, but if the horses got all the rest of that hair. Yeah, like that's not even like regular hair. That's like ripped right down to. Gracie did that. Yeah. She's so I was up at the house and I brought all this stuff down and I'm gonna show you guys it. But first I hear pounding. Whenever I hear pounding in the barn, I'm like, what are you doing to my barn? <laughs> Let's go look. Oh, <sighs> what'd you do? Oh, I see. This gate is falling down. The gate is falling down. I'm gonna put a new this in and try and put a wheel on that gate. So, so he's gonna put a wheel on this gate so that we don't, so because right now, see how it's hanging down? It rips it out of the wall. So if he puts a wheel on it, it'll hold it up and it'll be better. Right way. I think you're wrecking the barn. So remember when Sam put this, this broom up here? He saw it on TikTok. Sam was addicted to TikTok. But anyway, our horses love this thing. Literally love it. They scratch themselves, even the baby scratches on it. But Penny and Willow and Gracie love it. The boys, I never see scratch on it. So Willow's holding up pretty good on the grass, you guys. She's doing really good. Mom. We let her on, oops, we let her on the grass a little less than the other horses, but she's doing good. Okay, so now this bucket. Oh, cleaning out the basement, I found this book, Bandaging Your Horses. It's a guide to banding, bandaging your horses. And it has really good pictures and explains everything. Wait, there's a lot more pictures in it than that. But anyway, I'm excited that I found it. So I am going to put it in my first aid kit because I want to keep it with there. No sense having it in the basement. And then I found this book, 100 Ways for a Horse to Train Its Human, and I started reading it. A lot of these books and stuff that I found today will clean out the basement were things that I had bought for Gabby and for Sophie when they were just little tiny girls back before I was into horses. And now that I know horses, oh my gosh, it made me laugh so hard. Look at what my dog looks like. 
her whole body, her face. I don't know how her face gets wet. I know how her legs get wet. Okay, so this is super funny. Okay, impulsion. So this is from a horse's perspective. The desire to move forward, elasticity of the step, suppleness of the back, and engagement of the hindquarters. And another is another key word that your human might use. Your human's impulsion can be improved by chasing them. Sometimes just a menacing look is enough to dramatically increase the elasticity of their steps. <laughs> But the whole book is full of like funny things that we talk about about our horses and it's the horse trying to train train the human and it's so funny. So uh, the other thing that I brought down to the barn was, oh actually that's mine for the house. Oh, I need to put these away. These are the magnetic stirrup inserts. So I'm going to put those in there. But anyway, this is like a lot of the stuff that I keep at the house. Uh, you guys know we use baby powder at horse shows and then these are like a bunch of our grooming stuff and then we have stuff that we use for boots too. But this is all, this is all just a bunch of grooming products like to, this is all just a bunch of like saddle cleaning stuff uh, because whenever we clean our saddles we always do it at the house because it's more comfortable. But I'm going to bring it down here and put all of our saddle cleaning stuff together and find a spot for it in the barn. This is my dog. She's a full-on rat now. A full-on rat. <laughs> this is what she did. That's I mean, hard. She's so funny. <laughs> Don't you know that you're beautiful?